We're back, Magic Mountain, part four. Hey everybody, it's Paul, 125 Roller Coaster Challenge, and yes, we are back here again at Magic Mountain in front of Goliath, but I'm here because my friend Madon, say hi to your mom. Hi. All right, is here with me. So this is actually my fourth day uh, we did uh, magical uh, journey and all that kind of stuff there. We did one day that we did all the uh, the rides we could. Second day was the filming day. Uh, third day, of course, was well. I gotta get on X. And today is uh, there's nothing for me to do for my daughter's wedding. So what else are we gonna do, right? So we are back here, and M Madonna has never been here. She flew in from Pennsylvania too. So today is all about uh, showing her why I'm an idiot and getting on these stupid rides. So. Of course, we have to go to Twisted Colossus first. Uh, we do have some fan fast passes, and it is a Friday, so we're going to see how the crowds are. But uh, hey, you got a bonus one, so why don't you sit back and relax, and why don't you watch the medley? We just got off Twisted Colossus. Madon, what do you think? I loved it. It's my favorite one here. And it is a great one to start off the day there. Now, it's going to be tough to beat Twisted, Co Twisted Co Colossus, but I think that maybe Tatsu might. But we're going to head out this way here and uh, see what's open. There's a couple things that are closed already today. Uh, Scream's going, but really when you have limited time, no offense to Scream, it's a great coaster. I know it gets bypassed a lot, but truth of the matter is, Twisted Colossus twice or Scream once, I'm always going Twisted Colossus. So, all right, we're going to head out here towards DC Universe. Right, so right there you actually see uh, Brailler's Revenge and uh, Wonder Woman and we actually got on Wonder Woman Fly of Courage. Which did you like better? Still Twisted Colossus? Yeah, definitely. Definitely Twisted Colossus. It is an interesting ride though, isn't it? So it's a single rail. There is uh, there's a few of them, but this is kind of the longer version just like Jersey Devil over at uh, Great Adventure or Home Six Flags Park. So. Uh, it is slightly longer. It has another little section that Jersey Devil doesn't have. But so we got two coasters so far. Off to the next. All right. So while Madonna actually uh, goes grab another boba tea here, we actually got on Apocalypse the ride. Uh, when we got here, this ride was uh, pretty much uh, pretty much closed, and that's how it was most of the uh, the trip here. I know they were down the one train operations, so uh, we just wandered back here because uh, West Coast Racer is actually uh, closed, but that's actually an easier way right there, that path, to get up the hill to get to uh, Ninja and Tatsu. So I wandered back here, all of a sudden we saw people getting in line. I'm like, wait a second here, there's no blockage. And uh, we walked right in and we basically walked right on to Apocalypse. Uh, still one of my favorite uh, wooden coasters. Uh, I think I might like it better than uh, um, Ghost Rider. Now, now, of course, I've been on Apocalypse three times, Ghost Rider once. Um, so it's, it's pretty close there, but this is definitely one of uh, my favorite uh, GCI coasters. So it doesn't look like West Coast Racer is going. So I think our next bet is to uh, fill up our drinks. There goes Apocalypse there. Fill up our drinks and head up the mountain to uh, check out um, Tatsu and also Ninja. Oh, and there she is. All right, so next, next adventure.
everyone, we reached the summit and we just got off in Ninja. There's Madon resting as I uh, figure out what the watch times are here. Tatsu is going, which it was not going earlier here, but we do actually have a limited time today because of the fact that I have to uh, be there for my daughter's wedding uh, fairly soon. So we're gonna be checking the watch times here, but we are right there by Tatsu, Katie's Kettle, Roaring Rapids, New Revolution, Revolution stuff. And if we really get lazy right there is the Magic Mover, but uh, we're moving along pretty good. We actually, like I said, we got Apocalypse, which I didn't expect, uh, but we didn't get West Coast Racers because that one's down there. So we're just gonna keep on chilling out and uh, figuring out what's next. All right, we just got off of Tatsu and proof that there's reason for why so many different ice cream. What'd you think? Okay. Okay. Is it your favorite? No. All right. And that's why there's different kinds of ice cream people because to me, Tatsu is number one. So uh, this time we were in the second row, not the front row. So I've done the front row, back row, and uh, seat two. And uh, back row is a little bit more intense, but you get better visuals. But on all, Tatsu is in the books. Right, so right in front of me here is Viper, and we're about halfway done with our day, even a little bit more than halfway. So if you like what we do, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, usually don't have guest stars, but today we have Madonna's guest star. So, but we're gonna head over to right there, the classic coaster, New Revolution, or Classic Revolution, whatever they want to call it, Revolution, which was the first ever looping roller coaster. And right there is Tatsu, which is its bigger, 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 bigger brother. So, but we're gonna head over there right now. But uh, remember to like and subscribe and uh, check out some of our other uh, stuff on Magic Mountain. All right, we're back here at the front of the park here, and this is the new revolution, the classic revolution, new revolution. I don't know, it's revolution. So what would you think there of this classic historic ride? I like it. I like it. Okay. Let's head over this way here. We're going to show them the historic loop. Uh, and, of course, we got some music that I want to get away from so we don't get copyrighted, as they do sometimes here. But uh, now do, uh, here's a question. The orange guy or the white guy? Which one do you like better? Do you like Tatsu better? Or did you like Classic Revolution? I don't think that's a fair question because they're both so different. That is true. That is true. What's from 1976, which is, I am slightly older than that, but not as much, not as much as I would like it to be, you know, so. But right here's our carousel. Uh, now, I usually don't do carousels just because of the fact that uh, we're on a limited schedule today. We, we have to get out of here around 4 o'clock, uh, so... But this is a kind of a neat one here. It's a little bit more plastic than most. If you look at it, it just doesn't seem to have the, uh, the it's, it's definitely not Knobles, so. But uh, surprising to me though, the new revolution well, is actually long. Because you have the loop ring thing. Yes, yes, Knobles has the loop ring. But Hershey Park doesn't have that, but at least the horses look a lot more classic. So, all right, I'm gonna come over here real quick here and get this loop which is pretty iconic because it is what you see as soon as you come to the park and i can hear them coming right now so there we go look at that it's like i timed it like that it's amazing i'm getting so good at this uh add ego here so but we're gonna head over here now we're at the front of the park but we definitely want to get on goliath we're gonna check out full throttle and i don't know about you but i got a dole whip in my uh, future all right so it's a hot one today but it is day four so I kind of know my way around here now. Guess what? It's time for a montage. So we actually found some time. There's no line for full throttle, which is uh, pretty much a uh, 
70 mile per hour launch, but it's the biggest inversion right there, uh, looping coaster. And uh, it was pretty good. Now, I got on it on Monday, so our other photographer, Michelle, was not able to actually get on this. And Madon, what'd you think of full throttle? So, she thinks, uh, what is that? This is like right behind Twisted Cyclo uh, Colossus. Apocalypse might be a little bit heavy too. That was running great, but yeah, I've been enjoying this one too. Uh, like I said, I'm not used to hang, and to hang on this is uh, obscene, for lack of a better word. So we're gonna wait a second here and let this bad boy launch because I want you to see that hang. All right, so we were right outside the Bugs Bunny section. You can actually hear the Bugs Bunny music. So but it should be launching in a second, hopefully. Now the worst part of this ride is you can see right there on the, uh, you go over that top hat, is the brakes. Uh, that was really janky, we were in the back, so that wasn't exactly the best. But let's see if this thing launches. All right, so we're getting ready to launch now. I just wanna really show you this hang because it is insane. Especially for something that prides itself at 70 miles an hour. It is funny that you have this extreme ride right next to the uh, Bugs Bunny section. All right, are we building the anticipation here? Are you excited yet? These poor guys are race roasting right there. All right, I hear a lot of clicking, so we're hoping this is gonna happen. I might have to do some editing. And that, here we go. So that's 70 miles an hour, but in that back row right there, that hang is insane. So, all right, now we're gonna head over to Goliath and Dole Whip, uh, whichever one we hit first is what we're gonna get. Over there in the far end there is X. I haven't really seen X going up. Uh, I know they got slow operations for it, and uh, operations is the right word because my leg still hurts, but all right, we're gonna keep on moving here at Magic Mountain. There we go. That is Goliath. We just caught that. We just got off of Goliath, as you can tell by the beautiful uh, stonework here. But uh, yeah, so uh, what did you think of Goliath there? You like it too? But it's it's not Twisted uh, Colossus, but and Full Throttle. You said it's still ahead too, right? Yeah, I would say this is probably like what, fourth, number fourth on my list. Yeah, probably fourth because you like Apocalypse a lot too. So, all right, so. That is where the Dole Whip is, but we are not going for the Dole Whip quite yet because I have two front line passes with my name on it and I guess Madonna's name on it too. Uh, and we're gonna go to her number one coaster, which is? Uh, Twisted, Colossus. Twisted Colossus. So we're getting ready to wrap up. I was getting it wrong. It's Colossus, yeah, not Cyclone. There's a lot of Cyclones too, but it is Twisted Colossus. And uh, yeah, that is definitely like number two in my book. So we agree on something. Yeah, that's her number one, my number two. But uh, we're gonna head there. Uh, it's been a pretty good day. We do have to cut the day a little bit short just because uh, we have about an hour drive and I gotta start doing father duties for my daughter. So uh, eight o'clock apparently there's a meeting I gotta be at. So we're gonna head over and get on Twisted Colossus. All right, so we had to finish the day on a super high note here. So Madon, what just happened? Uh, we won a race. We, we got, got a race. race. They we made got, it on time. They did it. The, the staff did an amazing job. They got us here on uh, Twisted Cyclone, and we got a race. So you know what? There's no other way to end. That's what I always do. You call it Cyclone. Cyclone. I'm sorry. It's Colossus. <laughs> there's so many Cyclones, but you know what, though? There's no way that you can top that. So at this point, I'm just going to grab a Dole Whip and get out of Dodge. Now, this is your one day here at this park. This is my fourth day, so to end my fourth day 
on a race, which is very rare if you know anything about it here on Twisted Colossus. I can read it. So, <laughs> um, it's just a great way to end the day here. So we are going to uh, head out. We're going to go over and we're going to uh, skip screen because that was always on the plan there. But we're actually going to head on out now. It's going to be a day. Uh, so today we basically hit a lot. We hit Goliath. We hit uh, twice Colossus. We did, uh, oh, we got Apocalypse, which yeah, we did we not did. expect to get. I got so lucky because I was the lucky child. Yep, you were definitely lucky on that one. So we got uh, Apocalypse, we did Tatsu, we did Ninja. Uh, we did pretty much most of the big ones. The only two that we kind of missed, X2 because the line's three hours and my leg's so bruised. And I think that's about it. Oh, we did Full Throttle too. Yeah. And that was another one of your favorites. So your favorite is Twisted Colossus. Number two is probably what, Full Throttle? I don't, yeah, maybe, I don't know. Cause I really like Apocalypse, so yeah. those guys are there. And then Tatsu, which was my number one, is her number uh, four. Yeah. Notice I just said was my number one. My yeah. number one now, <laughs> Twisted Colossus. When you get a race, it's kind of like catching a, your star, your lucky star. It's like, you don't expect to get that. And then when you actually get that, uh, yeah, that is my number one now. I love you, Tatsu. Uh, you're still number two. You're probably still top 10, top 15 coaster. But uh, Twisted Colossus, uh, you definitely did. So once again, this is Point One Two Five Roller Coaster Challenge in the Scream Punk District here of Magic Mountain, and uh, you just watched our day at the park. So um, remember to like and subscribe, and uh, thank you for watching, and can't wait to see you in the queue.